ranking the success and failure rate of Manchester United transfer policy since Sir Alex Ferguson? It might be a silly question. It might be straightforward. It might be straightforward. Let's see if it is. <laughs> uh, Stevie, we're going to start with Paul Pogba. Hit or miss, success or failure? Well, you've got to say it's a, it's a miss. He's the guy that they spent all the money on to, to lead this team towards titles, championships, uh, and to be back up with the best. And it just hasn't happened. So you've got to say Paul Pogba has been a failure. And the flat rate of 105 million euros. Juan Mata. Listen, Juan Mata was past his best when Man United signed him. He was signed as a squad player. So you've got to say he's been a success as a squad player. He wasn't... He wasn't, in my opinion, somebody who was going to always be in the, the starting eleven. Okay, but he's done all right. This is a tough one. Yeah, twenty-seven and a half million he pounds. Because did, he did exactly what he was supposed to: annoy people, foul people, score some goals with headers. You got to say that this guy did exactly what this guy does when he was in a Man United jersey. So, is it success or failure? Success. There you go. Big success, I'd say. It has to be. Yeah. Um, <laughs> big in all senses. Latan Ibrahimovic. You've got to see his Latin as a success, no question. Unfortunately, the injury is, is what ended his career at United, but up until then, I would say he was a success. Papered over the cracks. Yeah. Luke Shaw. No. No. Not just because of the injury? You know, disappointing. I thought this was a great signing for United at the time when they got him from Southampton. Because for me, he was the up-and-coming fullback in the country. Mm. Just never materialised. And, and half of the problems, not only form, but fitness. Mm. And also, obviously, managing him. Do we need to say any more about this guy? Okay. Seriously? Two minutes? Mm -hmm. Angel Di Maria. Yeah. And the door. Back out quickly. Did they, did they, so was it all his fault? Absolutely. Okay. Memphis Depay. Oof. Absolute disaster. A guy with talent, no question. But at Manchester United, it was... I guess in the end, if you look at his career right now where it is, Man United was probably too early for him. Let's put it that way. Could they have been more patient? No. Okay. Sergio Romero. Yeah, he's a good backup. Yep. So you have to say that, that it would be a success. He uh, He's not the greatest goalkeeper in the world, but he's... <laughs> Listen, he's got... Over 50 caps, I think, for Argentina. Mm -hmm. That tells you that he's capable. Played so at the very highest level for yeah. them as well. Of course, yeah, in the he, World Cup. he's been a success. Mm -hmm. And see, Martial. I'm going to say no. This guy frustrates me. I once, you know, in the, in, the, in the football business, there are certain players that we say will get you the sack. Where is he? There he is. <laughs> he's up there. <laughs> <laughs> he's a guy that gets you the sack. You know, you play three games, he does absolutely nothing. You're about to take him off again. And he scores a stunning goal. And then it's like, oh, well, maybe this is going to start. And then the next three games is the same. And then you're going to take him off. And then he scores a stop. I'm sorry. I expected a lot more from this guy. Uh, and again, you kind of keep yourself fit. They, they paid for potential, didn't they? And that potential, you wouldn't yeah. say, has really come out under, under several managers. Correct. Romelu Lukaku. Well, it, <laughs> it can't have been that big a success if Manchester United got rid of him to leave themselves short up front. So that kind of tells you what they thought of Romelu Lukaku. Listen, I'm... I'm but well he was one of their better players. Uh, allegedly. Mm. Allegedly. Um, You've got to say he was a failure. Otherwise, he'd still be here. Right? Okay. Yeah, OK. I'm, I'm, I'm fine with that. Yeah, and me. He's not doing so badly now, is he? Uh, this is uh, the picture, then. We've got Romero, Ibrahimovic, Fellaini and Mata in the post Sir Alex era. Maybe that uh, tells the story. Here you go. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+.